Welcome to the Key Flow Show mini tutorial. This one is about the first steps to draw a diagram. It gives you a fast overview over the very basic functions of Key Flow Show. Please log in to Key Flow Show and click New Diagram. Enter a name and click Create in Selected Folder. In the Properties panel on the right side, open Design and find the Shapes and Icons tab. Drag a shape onto the white diagram surface. Enter a name and please notice that the panel on the right is now showing the item properties. Now change some design properties. For instance, set the background color, select the gradient, set a text color and add a shadow. In order to resize the item, click one of the green handles at a corner and drag it. The shift key helps you to get a perfect square. Let's check if the item looks good now. OK. Then save it to the item defaults. Now let's add another item and a connection between the two items. Need to notice the triangles next to the item? Click the one on the right and drag a connecting line. Hold the control key down to add an item at the end of the new connection. And release the mouse button. Sandkey Flow Show asks you for a value. For instance, enter the number 2 and click OK. Our diagram has now two items and a straight connection in between them. It's pretty simple to add a curve to the connection. Just click at the connection and drag out a point. I show it to you again. To delete a curve, click on its green handle. In Sandkey Flow Show you can branch a connection. Repeat the steps to add a connection and a new item. Now hold the control key down while you're dragging the new item. In this way you can clone it. In order to create a branch, drag a new line from a triangle. A line indicator shows up as you move over the existing connection line. Release the mouse button and enter a smaller value than before. One is good, for instance. See what has happened to the width of the branches. Add other items as you like. You may change an item's shape without the need to redraw any connection. A very helpful feature of Sankey Flow Show is the slider to change the width of all connection lines. Click on the white surface to select the diagram. Find the slider from maximum width in the diagram properties and change the value. It's a good idea to play around with the design properties of items, connections and of the diagram itself. The turn is on you now. Try out what you saw on www.sankeyflowshow.com Thanks for watching.